I, th I, do, I think it's a cool match. It's just very strategic. Each, each individual yeah. decision is super important. Yeah. Because, you know, you know neither character is really going to get in and deal a ton of damage at once. Mm -hmm. It's mostly War of Attrition. Yeah. And so each individual decision that you make can be the round. You, you know, some people uh, lose, sometimes people lose rounds in that match with having lost 30% life only. Yeah. So I, it's really it's really cool, but that's not what we're gonna see right now. K Brad coming up against Vivaldi. K Brad, Cami, Vivaldi, -K -Brad. Rufus. Yeah, Rufus, Cami. So Vivaldi's on the one player side. Yeah. Even though he's sitting on the right side of our of the uh, setup. Sorry. Or the left side of your screen, I guess. Yeah, it's like he's correct at home. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Both characters obviously, you know, good good damage potential. They both have uh, really good mix-ups. Uh, Cammy has a dragon punch, which yeah. I feel is a huge difference maker. In this yeah, for sure, for sure. I mean, uh, not so much as an anti-air option, but as a as a get off me get option, off me. or even as a, to throw it in in offensive strings. Right, right. Up buttons. I mean, obviously Rufus has a has a a better dive kick now. Uh, now that she can't do instant air tan. Uh, yes. So I mean, he, he has he has mix-ups that she doesn't really have access to, but yeah. her mix-ups are awesome anyway. Even if she, if she gets a knockdown, I mean that can be it. We've seen it from K. Brad plenty of times today. Oh yeah. He gets a knockdown, boom, that's it. Two series later, you're done. And against Rufus, who, who has low, lower than average stun, mm. yeah. you know, she can end him pretty quickly. All about who gets the momentum first. Very heavily momentum-based matchup. And it looks like it's K-Brad starting things off here. Okay, he saw it wasn't working out, and he, and he gets away. Okay, it's Vivaldi now. Oh, trying to wake up crouch tacking. Got him. Oh, 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 oh. Yep. Some characters you got to do the stand strong rather than catching medium kick. Oh, what a bait. Oh, almost got the punish. But Vivaldi getting out. He's being smart about it. Wow, crouching fierce? You know what he's probably doing is crouching fierce option select throw tech. Oh, true. Yeah. He might, he very well may be. Very close to ending it. Oh, delay, delay. Yeah, and Vivaldi essentially hit him with a dive kick, a jump roundhouse, and then like another dive kick. It can come down to just that. Gets a throw to start things up. Nice safe jump timing. Now there's FADC available to K. Bride. Just dashes up though. And I bet her stuff really works really well against wide body Rufus. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, crumple! Spends the bar to make it happen at the start. Good damage here. Good stun too. Oh, watch oh, out no. now. This could be beefy. Oh, no. Okay. Stun? No. Good stuff. Vivaldi avoids it. He's got to get himself some breathing room. He has three meters. k Brad has to be careful. He's going to go right into the ultra here. Nice confirm. One of the buffs that Rufus got in this version was that stand short, stand around us. Now hits even if people are crouching. Mm. Oh, and he missed, I think, a dive kick. Oh. Or just a cross up. Oh. Really? Uh... I think he might have ended up safe had he not FADC'd that, and that's going to be uh, missing out on those meters. Uh, wow! I just did it raw. It's just really pressing the button right after a dive kick. And if there's one thing I would like to see in uh, Vivaldi's game, and I know he's capable of it, is just throwing out that delayed Messiah kick after a dive kick here and there, establish some pressure, and he had three meters before he did that at FADC. You know, wow, K-Brad, sticking out those crotch fierces. Oh, I like that. That's a cool option. Yeah. Nice, there's that dragon punch. Yeah. Oh, nice, he goes low. What's he got here? Great. Vivaldi has not been caught by that yet. Instead, he gets his own instant dive kick. Stand short, stand around us, ultra. It's not terribly damaging, but it sets up a good situation afterward. Oh. Oh, oh no. he does another, and he misses that, gets the overhead. I'm Vivaldi. Not sure. I'm not sure what's happening right now. Oh my god, just Messiah. Yeah, he's got to do it. Again. And again, yeah. Oh, you know what? Wow. I wonder, I wonder what he was doing right there. It got really nasty towards the end there. There was some grimy stuff happening. Yeah, I mean, when, when things kind of get gross like that, go to your fastest button.
I mean, that's why K-Brad got caught with that Messiah, but that's why he got that combo in the same thing, in the same vein. Oh! Sick. Oh, nice finally gets that grab, and he's close to stun. Oh, same side. Yep. Boom. Yep. yep. What a. And he trained him with setup. the cross up already. Ended up on the same side that time, and Vivaldi's just not ready. Looking at a perfect. Oh, we're playing cross here? I mean, if, if he can force Vivaldi to spend meter to get out of this, that'd be right, great. Right, right. He would be a fool to use so the meter. Smart. What a smart pressure. Right. Yeah, if, if Vivaldi had used the X to get out of it, then fine. Hey, Cami has so many opportunities to not die. Right. And it would have been great for him if Rubens had started this round with no meter. Now, what Vivaldi has to do is at least take advantage of that small victory and not using meter. He has to make those meters count in this round. There oh it is. My God. The crowd is going nuts for this one. There oh, it is. Oh, wow. From all the way up, all the way down. And Vivaldi reels back in his seat. He does not like the result of that. Vivaldi's going to be eliminated here at seventh place. K Brad will move on. Loser's bracket. Civil